This short video will show you how to extract your Apple Health data to a CSV file and display some graphs. First, navigate to your Apple Health application and then search for the export link. Tap on the export link and then tap again. At this point, the data will be exported. This may take several minutes depending on the size of the file. Choose the location on your device and name the file accordingly. Once the file is saved on your device, navigate on your browser to snapdrop.net. Do the same on your laptop. This will allow the phone and your device to connect to each other locally over your own network. At this point, verify that the names of the computers are the same, then choose the file that you just saved to your device. Once selected, the file will begin transferring to your laptop. Of course, if you're using a Mac, this would be much easier in that you can use AirDrop instead. Once the file is finished transferring, click on the button to allow it to save to the machine. You may get a warning, as I did here, that the file is, may be harmful. You can choose to ignore this, keep the file, keep anyway, and at that point, you can then open up the zip file that was extracted now from your phone to your PC. Within the zip file, there are a number of files. The file we need is called export.xml. Compressed, it's quite small, but with all, depending on the amount of data you have, it could be quite large. Right-click and copy this file, and then navigate to a spot on your file system where you'd like to store this file and click the paste icon. Let the file copy. Then within the web browser, navigate to healthspanbox.com. On this web page, go to the calculators And there you will see a heart rate export link. Click on this link. This page runs entirely on your client web browser and sends no data to the server. Click the open link and select the location and file where you saved the export.xml. Then if you'd like, check the save CSV file and select a file name for that file somewhere on your computer. Click Save, and then click this icon in the middle to begin the extract and transform to CSV. And at that point, the CSV file will be saved. And you'll also see a number of graphs on the page showing heart rate ranges over the course of the time in which the data was recorded, as well as a number of graphs indicating areas where heart rate may have been low, as well as average heart rates for day days over the last three months, and heart rate averages over the last month hourly. The CSV file may be quite large, but it should contain all of the data exported from the XML into a comma delimited CSV file, at which point you could use within Excel or another data analytics tool. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps. Cheers.